Hello friends, welcome back. Today we're just gonna be talking about brown butter. Now what is brown butter? Brown butter is, it's just butter that has been cooked until it turns golden brown. That's really all it is. It has a nutty, sweeter, almost a caramel-like flavor. It smells so good. You can put it on all kinds of things. You can use it to bake. You can use it in savory dishes like pasta. It can be used in so many different ways. It's super easy. So. I'm gonna show you how to make it. So I'm gonna start by cutting up your stick of butter. Put that in a pan on medium high heat and let your butter melt. Personally, I like to use a lighter colored or silver pan instead of a dark one, just so that I can see the progress of the butter in the color well. Additionally, cutting your butter up will help it to melt evenly. So that's why we do that. As it melts, you can stir it with a heat proof spatula or a spoon or you can swirl the pan around as I'm doing here. This just helps our butter to cook evenly because we don't want any of it to burn. So it's important to keep moving it around and pretty much constantly stir it or swirl it in the pan. So now that our butter is melted, we can see all of this foaminess. It's gonna start bubbling here. When it starts to bubble like crazy and get super foamy, this is called spluttering. This means that the water is being cooked off and now the fat is popping. So it'll look yellow like it is here. And once it stops spluttering, then you're left with the fat and the milk solids. As it cooks off, the milk solids start to be more noticeable. So if you see stuff in your butter that looks a little like sand, that's the milk solids. We want to leave them in though because they carry so much of that flavor. So even though they look toasted, they might look a little funny, leave them in. So we just wanna keep that butter moving and swirling. And after a couple of minutes, it'll have this deep golden brown color. It'll start smelling pretty toasty, like caramel. These milk solids are gonna be super visible as soon as your butter has this nice deep golden color. You can take it off the heat right away because if you leave it in the pan, it will continue to cook and it will burn. Okay, so our butter is brown and beautiful. Look at that color. It smells amazing. So now it's ready to be used.